Hey guys, so today I'm going to teach you guys how to play Flow Reader's new song Whistle on the guitar. And I can't have to back this up because I'm going to So let's do the chords for the song are A minor, F, C, and then D. Except for the beginning part with the plucking, all you're going to do is you're going to take your middle finger and you're going to put it on the third fret. And that's in the beginning. Um, so for the beginning of the song, it, you, do the, you do finger plucking. Which I don't know how many of you know that what that is, but it's where you take your thumb and you're gonna play the bass note of it. So for A minor, the bass note is on the A string. For F, depending on whether you play your F like this, whether you take it and you do it this way, will kind of depend on what your bass note is. If you're doing it like this, your bass note is D, but if you play it as a bar chord, or whatever this is, I'm not sure what it is, then your bass note is on the E, and then so your thumb plays the bass note, C is the same, C is the, uh, A, and then for G, your bass note is E. Because it's, it's the lowest uh, string you play. But, so when you do finger plucking, you do the bass note, and then your. I do my pointer, my middle, and I don't know if this is actually my ring finger, but the finger that I have my ring on, they do the bottom three strings. So for A, it sounds something like this. So you just. So you play the bass, and then you go down, so you play uh, E, B, e, and then E. And that's what it is for there. So in the beginning, it's A minor with the goes. That one you don't play the chord. All you do is you just put your uh, ring finger on the third fret of the E string, and you play that as the bass note, and then the bottom, well, the bottom three strings. Um, so So it's over with the chorus and then it comes in with the chorus and then when it starts to the verses instead of at you still do the A minor, the F and the C. But once you're done with that, then you go instead of just playing the third, you're gonna play G. Instead, so it'd be back and forth between that. So it's something like this. And I don't play the beginning part when I play the song. So that's pretty much how it goes. 
videos, and I've, I haven't, I've only heard this song a couple times, so I really only know up to that far in the song. But after the chorus, when it, when it says, here we, here we go, when it hits, here we go, I just, I don't put, I don't finger plus the entire thing, I just play the E string and then stop it, and then I go right into it, and the pattern is, down, 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 down. down. So it's down, down, down. Or it's down, down, down. And there's no capo on this song at all, as you can see, because I don't have a capo. So any song that I play, I have to transfer down, so there's no capo. But um, I'm hoping this was helpful to anybody who wanted to learn how to song, how to play this song. And if you guys want to learn another song, just give me a, or just post a comment on the next song you want me to play. And teach you guys how to play, and I will see if I can find it. Otherwise, I'm just going to start uploading a couple of videos on it. So, yeah. Bye. I'll probably put out uh, one or two other videos today.